how we, how would you describe how our coaching works together? So I'm not asking you about me per se. I'm asking you sort of like the, the process. How would you describe how the process works for you? I would say that it's like you hold up a mirror mm-hmm. um, and help me see more yeah. clearly what's going on with myself. And then you help me sort of tease apart the the different threads to switch metaphors entirely um, mm-hmm. and untangle things. And, and just so I could lay everything out and see what it looks like so then I can decide what to do. Uh, that, that gentle teasing right. out uh, and unraveling of the knots is uh, very freeing. Okay. You said the simplest thing, and I'm so glad you said it. Then I can decide what to do. Then I can decide what to do. Mm. I think good coaching is about helping you, the client, make your own decisions. Yes. Um, but but we struggle with making our own best decisions sometimes when we have too much going on, or when we're stressed or under threat because of pressure or overwhelm. And, and what coaching can do is help bring you back or it's like lending you my thinking brain in a sense and, and creating that space. And I like the way you said, like turning the mirror. Um, it's, it's just open and meant to help you see all of your options and then choose what's best for you in, in a frame that builds upon your own strengths. Yes. Because if I were to have said to you, well, John, Carl, you know, your scheduling is terrible and you really need to start booking things in your calendar. Well, you probably have never would have come back. <laughs> or you might have thought, well, yeah, I do need to put things in my calendar, but I don't want to. <laughs> mm-hmm. yeah. That's that's the, the magic, I think, is finding out um, how you can do things and that's why we want to be entrepreneurs right yes yes in part because we've got our own ideas but also in part because we would like to work in in a way that serves us best yes well and it's interesting because um there have been a number of coaches Mm -hmm. i've interviewed some are sex and intimacy coaches, some are relationship coaches, lifestyle coaches. Um, Mm -hmm. And one of the things I I do like about your approach is that um, it's very gentle, but it's also very practical. Um, Mm. I come away with things to do, things I can do that I feel comfortable with. Um, mm-hmm. and that, uh, that really helps me be productive. Perfect. That's what we want. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Well, how do you feel now? We've been working together for, I guess, about uh, three months, um, about the, the future success of, of this passion project, this book. I know it's early. Um, you know, we can't, you know, predict outcomes, right. but what is your general feeling from a couple of months ago to now? Well, I feel like my passion project is real. It exists. Mm-hmm. Um, it's meaningful. Uh, just raising the issues is helping other people think through how they conduct their lives and what they want out Mm -hmm. of life. The project is taking a life of its own and my job is to steer it like a, you know, a spirited horse. (laughs) 